Hey guys, welcome. Today we'll be doing the Inguinal Canal and the mnemonic would be a bit of a weird one. Romans had Instagram. Notice that Instagram is with an I and a G, so we have two letters over here. All right, we're gonna start right away. So the Inguinal Canal is, um, has an oblique orientation. It starts at the deep and ends at the superficial inguinal ring. So let's draw this. So that would be our inguinal canal. So this bit here would be our deep inguinal ring. It's like a slit in the peritoneum and here would be our superficial inguinal ring rings I'm gonna say okay so in men this is longer and larger and this now our rings would be our R okay and then we've got um, H which means that this is a spot for hernia spot for hernia now, if the hernia appears to come from this direction, it would be an indirect hernia. And if it appears from this direction, it would be a direct hernia. All right. Now, let's talk a bit about the border. So you've got the roof and the roof would be the transversus. This is the deeper version. So right above would be the transversus abdominis the fibres of it and the internal oblique muscle along with the falx inguinalis. All right, then we move on to the posterior side, which would be the transverse, transversalis fascia. Then the lateral sides would be the inter Fulviola ligament, while the medial would contain the reflected ligament. Okay, now we move on to the rest of our, our Instagram mnemonic, uh, which shows the contents. Now, I haven't included two things in the mnemonic just because it's different for males and for females. For example, males have the spermatic cord going through the inguinal canal. And while females have the round ligament of the uterus going through this. For I've mentioned Instagram because uh, you have this common in both sexes. And so we've got the ilio inguinal nerve. Ilioinguinal nerve, which if you remember from the lumbar plexus L1, and you've got the genital branch of the genital femoral nerve, which if you remember again from the uh, lumbar plexus, sorry, would be L1 and L2. Okay, that is our mnemonic and a bit about the structure. So this would be our deep structure. If you had to go and look from a superficial point of view, we'd see these things now we still also see this if you think it's important okay so this would be our n a b and this is our femoral canal this is our femoral uh, nerve femoral artery femoral vein Okay, now this is important, this and this is the medial and the lateral cruise. And this over here is our inguinal ligament. It runs through, right? So this would also be our inguinal ligament. Then here you've got the intercrural fibers. Here you've got the aponeurosis of the external oblique, aponeurosis of the external oblique, 
And here, if you just want to know, if you want to know, here would be the lateral cutaneous nerve of the thigh, which is also in the lumbar plexus. So that is the air inguinal canal, short and sweet, the deep view, the superficial view, the borders, the contents, and yeah, take care, guys.